I was asked to do a series of songs um, and kind of curate curate this this uh, this event of, of music, and I I picked a bunch of things and um, was asked to do the national anthem and. You know, obviously there's been a lot of conversation about the National Anthem over the last couple of years, um, at least in the, in the media. There's been a lot of conversation about the National Anthem over the last few decades, um, just not as, not as big a news. Um, but it's important to, 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 to break it down a little bit, because uh, as we heard from uh, Titus and Annette yesterday and, and many of the speakers, you know, this, and, and as we know, this country is divided. Um, we, not, we are not as united as, as we want to be, and while we are in here in this room um, uh, acting on the united front, uh, there's a lot of forces in this country that try and tear that apart. Uh, the national anthem was written by Francis Scott Key while he was in a ship uh, captured by the Brits, or telling a story about a guy, uh, being in a ship, captured by the Brits, watching this fort being bombed and seeing the flag stand. And, um, you know, that's, that's noble, you know, to talk about this flag that withstood the bombardment of bombs and stuff. That's, I get that. Um, but there are lyrics in this four stanza poem that turned out to be the national anthem that don't represent all of Americans as we see it. There's, there's, two, there's two types of Americans in this country um, that are over and over not represented. That's the first peoples, the Native Americans, um, whose country was stolen from them. And then there's the African Americans who were brought here from their country to build another country, quite literally, on, uh, on the backs of African American slaves. So we are a country of immigrants, for the exception of those two groups. And in the national anthem um, are words that uh, to the, the, hireling, the hireling and the slave, um, uh, basically a comment that, uh, that the hireling, that the people hired to fight against the Americans, and the slaves who, who wanted to fight against the Americans for the situation that they were in, um, uh, were you know, effectively uh, cowards and... and and um, we're fighting against this great American tradition. Um, one of the things that I, I think is part of reckoning and repair for me is realizing um, that the America that, was, that, that we built this country off of wasn't, wasn't, wasn't created for everybody at the time that it was created. And, and I think that we recognize now the beauty that comes from diversity and um, bridging uh, cultures and traditions and customs. And we recognize the innovation and the ingenuity and, the, and all, all the wonderful things that come, can come out of that. But when this country was founded, um, even as uh, they said, you know, uh, Washington and, and Jefferson recognized the, the abhorrence of, of slavery, and, but nothing was done about it. And so, so often nothing gets done about it. It's talked about and it's said, oh, you know, that's a shame. We shouldn't we shouldn't be doing this, but nothing happens, right? That's why we're here, to make something happen. But this song um, doesn't represent all of Americans. So what do we do about that? You know, and I think a lot of people say, okay, well, why don't we, why don't we take this song back and, and, and make it our own again? But in order to really effectively do that, we would have to rewrite the lyrics, right? And then it would be a whole new poem. Not to mention that the, po the song itself is based off a melody from a gentleman's club in England. You know, wh how, what, am what is American about that? So it's really important that we look to our history, obviously, to, to determine how we're going to um, best move forward. Um, but you have to analyze the history. You can't just read the textbook. You've got you to know what you're reading, and you've got to read in between the lines and, and, and determine is what, what, what am I missing? What part of the picture am I missing here? I'm going to play the national anthem. I'm not going to sing it. I'm going to, I'm going to play it on, the, on, on this here fiddle. And, um, and, and I, I, you know, I, I encourage you guys to, you know, if you want to sing the song, sing the song. But I encourage you to, um, 
think about, you know, what, what is a national anthem? You know, when you go to other countries around the world, what, what are the words that are being spoken? What are they talking about? What are they, what are they prizing about their country that they want to be able to sing about as a, as a nation together? And what are those words that, that are supposed to be said? So, uh, good morning. <laughs> Thank you.